Hello everybody, my name is Cameron and today we are starting Portal 2 Electric Boogaloo. I'm going to be running through the single player campaign first and then at some point later on in the future I'd like to do co-op, but right now we're going to start the single player. Good morning. You have been in suspension for 50 days. In compliance with state and federal regulations, all testing candidates in the Aperture Science Extended Relaxation Center must be revived periodically for a mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. Looks like a nicer place than we started off in the last the buzzer, in the last game. Look up at the ceiling. Ah. Good. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look down at the floor. Ah, Vietnam Good. flashbacks. This completes the gymnastic portion of your mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. There is a framed painting on the wall. Please go stand in front of it. This is art. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, stare at the art. You should now feel mentally reinvigorated. <laughs> staring at art has not provided the required intellectual sustenance. Reflect briefly on this classical music. Ah, oh, jeez. Good. Now, please return to your bed. Good morning. You have been in suspension for nine, 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 nine. Nine, nine. This call Hello? Is Anyone in there? Hello? The Not gonna lie. Are you <sighs> open the door? At any time? To have exercised that knock on the door sound effect sounded like it was coming from my actual door. That scared the shit out of me. This door. Ah! Ah! Oh, Jesus Christ. You look um, good. Looking good, actually. Are you okay? Are, are you... Well, don't answer that. I'm absolutely sure you're fine. There's plenty of time for you to recover. Just take it slow. Please prepare for emergency evacuation. Stay calm. Stay, stay calm. Prepare. It's all the same. Prepare. It's all fine. All right. Don't move. I'm going to get us out of here. Oh, you might want to hang on to something. Word of advice. Up to you. Uh, I'll hang on to the microwave. The most important thing in here. You all right down there? Can you hear me? Hello? Most test subjects do experience some uh, cognitive deterioration after a few months in suspension. Now, you've been under for quite a lot longer, and it's not out of the question that you might have a very minor case of serious brain damage. But don't be alarmed, all right? Uh, although, if you, do, if you do feel alarmed, try to hold on to that feeling, because that is the proper reaction to being told that you've got brain damage. Do you understand what I'm saying at all? Does any of this make any sense? Just tell me. Just say yes. Okay, what you're doing there is jumping. <laughs> jumped, but never mind. Say apple. Apple. <laughs> okay, you know what? That's close enough. Just hold tight. I came out of stasis and I'm immediately retarded. Please prepare for reactor core meltdown. Okay, look, I wasn't going to mention this to you, but I'm in uh, pretty oh, hot water here. How are you doing down there? You still holding on? The reserve power ran out. So, of course, the whole relaxation center stops waking up the bloody test subjects. Hold on, this is a bit tricky. And, of course, nobody tells me anything. No, why should you tell me anything? Why oh, jeez. No, my microwave. You know, about the life functions of the 10,000 bloody test subjects I'm supposed to be in charge of. 10,000? Right, close. Can you see? Am I going to make it through? I've got enough space. Uh... Just you're, good. you're good. You're good. Just you're good. You're good. And whose fault do you think it's going to be when the management comes down here and finds 10,000 flipping vegetables? Alright, so now I hit that one. I hit that one. Fun fact the hardest part of any vegetable to eat is the wheelchair. Okay, listen. We should get our story straight, alright? If anyone asks, and no one's going to ask, don't worry, but if anyone asks, Tell them as far as you know, the last time you checked, everyone looked pretty much alive. Alright? Not dead. Okay, almost there. On the other side of that wall is one of the old testing tracks. There's a piece of equipment in there that we're going to need to get out of here. I, I think this is a docking station. Wonder what that... I wonder what that piece of equipment could be. Oh, jeez. Whoa. Good news. That is not a docking station. So there's one mystery solved. 
Uh, I'm going to attempt a manual override on this wall. Could get a bit technical. Hold on. Manual override, he says. Remember, you're looking for a gun that makes holes. Not bullet holes. But don't worry, you'll figure it out. Seriously, do hold on this time. Oh, jeez. Eh. Achievement, let's go. Temperature science Experiencing technical difficulties due to circumstances of potentially apocalyptic significance. Oh, maybe it'll play that banger again. However, thanks to emergency testing protocols, testing can continue. These pre-recorded messages will provide instructional and motivational support so that science can still be done, even in the event of environmental, social, economic, or structural collapse. Hey guys, look, this cell has a copy of Halo 5 Guardians. Oh, this is just like the first game. Wait, am I the same person? Oh, I'm the same person. What? Got the messed up legs. Got the Forrest Gump braces. Oh, man. The flashbacks that it's giving me. Emergency? Don't worry. The odds of this happening twice are very slim. You have just passed through an Aperture Science Material Emancipation Grail, which vaporizes most Aperture Science equipment that touches... If you think Elevators are a little different. Down your neck, relax, lie on your back, and apply immediate pressure to your tablets. You are simply experiencing a rare reaction in which the material emancipation grill may have emancipated the ear tubes inside your head. <laughs> oh man. Oh cool. Okay, so it switches. Oh nice. So I need to get this and pick it up and bring it through here. And then press this button over here. And do the same thing. I'm learning. Good. Because of the technical difficulties we are currently experiencing, your test environment is unsupervised. Before re entering a relaxation vault at the conclusion of testing, please take a moment to write down the results of your test. An Aperture Science Reintegration Associate will revive you for an interview when society has been rebuilt. <laughs> oh, I love the writing of these games. They're so good. It's so funny. Yeah, I originally wasn't going to do Portal 2 for a while, but popular demand insisted that I, uh, that I go ahead and run through it. And by popular demand, I mean two people wanted me to. So I was like, yeah, okay. Animal King Takeover. <laughs> hey, hey, you made it. Ooh. There should be a, a portal device. Oh! oh shit. Hello. Can you see the portal gun? Oh yeah, nice. I can. And gotcha. Work on the assumption that you're still alive, and I'm still waiting for you up ahead. I'll wait, I'll wait one hour, then I'll come back, and assuming I can locate your dead body, I'll bury you. All right? Brilliant. Go team! See you in an hour, hopefully. If you don't... See you in an hour. Some emergency testing may require prolonged interaction with lethal military androids. Rest assured that all lethal military androids have been taught to read and provided with one copy of the laws of robotics. To share. Good. <laughs> you know that a lethal military android has not respected your rights as detailed in the laws of robotics. Please note it on your self-reporting form. A future Aperture Science Entitlement Associate will initiate the appropriate grievance filing paperwork. This next test is very dangerous. To help you remain tranquil in the face of almost certain death, smooth jazz will be deployed in three... Oh my god. Two, one. <laughs> Wonder if I'll get another copyright strike on my video for this music. I knew I was gonna get one for the uh, still alive song at the end of Portal One, and it, sh and it sure happened.
Oh, these are like the portals from the first game. Aw. Pretty easily solved. Almost as if I've done this before. Oh, wait a minute. I think you need a second block. Alrighty, there we go. We got the second block. Great work. Because this message is pre recorded, any observations related to your performance are speculation on our part. Please disregard any undeserved compliments. Any undeserved compliments. Oh, shit. Oh, well, nice. That certainly wouldn't have lacerated my bare feet or anything. Ready for that advanced portal gun. If the enrichment center is currently being bombarded with fireballs, meteorites, or other objects from space, please avoid unsheltered testing areas wherever a lack of shelter from space debris does not appear to be a deliberate part of the test. A deliberate part of the test. Nice, okay. So that's up there. I'm probably gonna have to... Might have to launch myself at some point. We'll see. Oh, stairs, cool. There's gotta be a cube around here somewhere. Yeah, like that. Nice. Rick and Morty IQ part two. Cool, glad that toppled right off of there. Nice. Well done. The Enrichment Center reminds you that although circumstances may appear bleak, you are not alone. All Aperture Science personality constructs will remain functional in apocalyptic, low-power environments of as few as 1.1 volts. This next test applies the principles of momentum to movement through portals. If the laws of physics no longer apply in the future, God help you. <laughs> Love the optimism. Okay, yes, yeah, so this is going to be pretty familiar from the last game. Um, the explanation that GLaDOS gives where it's just like, you'll see how um, portals affect momentum, or more accurately, how they do not. You need to find me that box. Oh, there it is. Okay, cool. Oh, I was hoping it would just happen to happen to land. No matter. I'll go get it. And let's hope this works. Yeah. Honestly, I only half expected that to work. If you are a non-employee who has discovered this facility amid the ruins of civilization, welcome. Hey, that's me. Testing is the future, and the future starts with you. Okay, let's see what we're working with here. Ooh, okay. Yeet. I assume that went. Oh, it landed down there. Oh, damn it. I'm 
trippy. Alright, that's there. And so now you can cool. Good work getting this far, future starter. That said, if you are simple-minded, old, or irradiated in such a way that the future should not start with you, please return to your primitive tribe and send back someone better qualified for testing. <laughs> not as charming as GLaDOS, I will say, but maybe we'll run into her again? I mean, the ending of the last game made it clear that she was very much, as the title would suggest, still alive. To ensure that so. power remains for core testing protocols, all safety devices have been disabled. The Enrichment Center respects your right to have questions or concerns about this policy. Hey! Oi, oi! I'm up here! <laughs> oi, oi! <laughs> what is this, you JoJo? A portal gun. Oh, the... Do you know what? It just goes to show people with brain damage are the real heroes in the end, aren't they, at the end of the day? Brave. Pop a portal on that wall behind me there, and I'll meet you on the other side of the room. Okay, listen, let me lay something on you here. It's pretty heavy. They told me never, never, ever to disengage myself from my management rail or I would die. But we're out of options here. So get ready to catch me, all right, on the off chance that I'm not dead the moment I pop off this thing. On three. Ready? One. Two. Three! That's oh. It's, it's too hard. <laughs> All right, going on three just gives you too much time to think about it. Let's uh, go on one this time. Okay, ready? One. Catch me, catch me. Oh, shit. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. I'm not dead. I'm not dead. <laughs> Plug me into that stick on the wall over there, yeah? And I'll show you something. You'll be impressed by this. Um, yeah, I can't do it if you're watching. Oh, my God. <laughs> I'm not joking. Can you just turn around for a second? Fine. All right, you can turn around now. Bam! Secret panel. Got open while your back was turned. And off we go. Oh, there's a portal up there. Okay. Uh, wait, no, that's my portal. Oh, right here. Cool. Look at this. No rail to tell us where to go. Oh, this is brilliant. We can go wherever we want. Just hold on, though. Where are we going? Seriously. Hang on, let me just get my bearings. Um, get his ball bearings, more like. Ayo! Hello. Oh, no. Yes. Oh, Hello. shit. No, we're not stopping. Don't make eye contact. Whatever you do. No, thanks. We're good. Appreciate it. Keep moving. Keep moving. Huh. For a turret, that turret was pretty polite. Oh. Probably ought to bring you up to speed on something right now. In order to escape, we're going to have to go through her chamber, and she will probably kill us if if she's um, awake. I wonder who her might be. It's probably definitely Glados, but okay. I'm going to lay my cards on the table. I don't want to do it. I don't want to go in there. Don't don't go in there. <laughs> she's off. She's off. Don't panic over. <laughs> All fine. On we go. Hey, it's Glados. Oh, nice. Is. What a nasty piece of work she was. Honestly. A proper maniac. I know, I was there. Do you know who ended up taking her down in the end? You're not going to believe this. A human. I wow. I wouldn't have believed either. Apparently this human escaped and uh, nobody's seen him since. Ooh. There was a sort of long chunk of time where um, absolutely nothing happened. Ah! Oh, still held. Still being held. You that's a great job. You've applied the grip. We're all fine. That You've applied the grip. Ah! I just, sorry, I just looked down. I do not recommend it. Ah! I've just done it again. Oh, I already like the voice acting in this game, too. This is the main breaker room. Look Whoa. for a switch that says... Well, holy shit. All right, don't touch anything else. Not interested in anything else. Don't touch anything else. Don't, don't even look at anything else. Just, well, obviously you've got to look at everything else to, to find the escape pod. But as soon as you look at something, it doesn't say escape pod. I'll look at something else. Look at the next thing. All right, but don't touch anything else or look at anything. Well, look at other things, but don't... You understand. He sounds like the guy who voices, um... Sean uh, from, from, um, the Assassin's in, Creed series. Let there be light. That's uh, God. Just quoting God. Oh, look at that. Turning. Ominous. But probably fine, as long as it doesn't start, you know, moving up. Now, 
Escape pod, escape pod. This is moving up. Okay. Okay. No, don't We're really moving up in the world. Got it. This should slow it down. No, makes it go faster. <laughs> uh -oh. Classic. Power up initiated. Okay, don't panic. All right, stop panicking. Uh, I can, I can still stop this. Um, oh jeez. Oh jeez. Okay, oh jeez. Not a problem. Oh no. Oh, I don't like this. A a a a a. Um. Oh no. Okay. A a a a a. Wait, did I do big double jump pens? Not writing these down. Power up, complete. I don't. Okay, okay, okay. Listen. All right, new plan. Act natural. Act natural. We've done nothing wrong. Hello. Oh. Ah, uh, Glados. It's been a long time. How have you been? I've been really busy being dead. You know, after you murdered me. You did what? Could let bygones be bygones. Oh god. Oh no. Oh no! No 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 no! Oh no 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 no! Ah. Okay, look. We both said a lot of things that you're going to regret. But I think we can put our differences behind us. For science. You monster. <laughs> I will say, though, that since you went to all the trouble of waking me up, you must really, really love oh, it. Oh, no. I love it, too. There's just one small thing we need to take care of first. Oh, Jesus. There was fire in here last time. Oh. Hey, achievement unlocked. Wait, I have the achievement alarm somewhere here. It's around here somewhere. Oh, I'm, maybe it's in my other pants. Uh, no, yeah, yeah. Nice. Oh jeez, we're falling. Whoa, whoa, holy... Ah. Here we are. The incinerator room. Be careful not to trip over any parts of me that didn't get completely burned when you threw them down here. Whoa. The portal device should be around here somewhere. Once you find it, we can start testing, just like old times. Nice. All right. Well, this is where I'm going to call it for part one of Portal 2. So thank you all so much for watching. And uh, yeah, be, be looking for the next part here soon. All right. Bye.